Welcome, welcome back at any help at C squared. In this example, we have to find the value of each variable x and y and this triangle. And if you notice, this triangle has this angle 30, this angle in si it's 60, and obviously this one is 90. This is what we call a special right triangle 30, 60, 90. And you see here the property in the box, but also you can see here uh, in this picture the same property. I'm, I'm going to use this picture for this example. And if you notice, x goes with this n. So if I find the n, I have the x. Uh, how do I find the n? I'm, like, I'm looking to this 42, which I can match it with this n square root of 3. So basically, I'm going to write an equation here. 42 equals n square root of 3. And I'm going to solve for n. So that means divide by square root of 3. And I have n equals 42 over square root of 3, which is not a bad answer. However, we're going to rationalize. And we're going to multiply by this 1, right? Square root of 3 over square root of 3 is 1. So we end up with 42 over um, square root of 3 over 3, because square root of 3 times square root of 3 is 3. And one, what else you can do? You can simplify here. 3 goes in. 42, um, 14 times. So the final answer for n is 14 square root of 3. But again, don't forget, this n is this x. So basically we have x equals 14 square root of 3. And we finish with x. But what about the y? If you notice why it's here and is nothing else than 2n. So y will be 2 times 14 square root of 3 because that is how much n is and that will be 28 square root of 3. y is 28 square root of 3 and that's it. If you enjoyed this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back on c square for more help. Thank you.